Welcome back to our communities, our children. Um, you know, I know this has been a very fast-paced show. As I suggested, we're going to have some of these young brothers come back in the future. We're going to be following up with them. We're going to hear about how they're rising above the streets and the circumstances and uh, continuing to turn around and transform their lives. Kai of Graphics, I want you to take us out, man. Yeah, thank you, Lee. Um, you know, and, and, and lastly, you know, as Greg said and, and, and as Audley said, you know, um, if anybody, man, you know, is looking to get out of this thing, you know, part of the reason why I put this thing together, you know, I sat in, in, in prison cells and I designed this program and I came out here and I launched it. And, you know, the, the overall objective of this program is to create ways to get young brothers and sisters out of the situations that they're in because the majority of them feel like they're trapped. The majority of them feel like they're hopeless. You know, that's why the program is here. You know, we're in, we're in quite a number of cities. And, and in New York City, we're in quite a number of schools. You know, and um, really quickly, I want to speak to the Trayvon Martin situation. Um, the graphics program, in conjunction with the Kai Smith show, I do have um, a, a, a regionally broadcast talk show. It's called the Kai Smith Show. If you uh, want information, you can go to www.kaismithshow.com and you can see the setup. We are in the process of doing a five borough tour to give young teenage kids the opportunity to express how the Trayvon Martin situation makes them feel. So we're going to be in, in, in five very large schools in five different boroughs of New York City. We already have, you know, six, seven, eight hundred people per borough. So again, it's under the auspice of prevention. What happened to Trayvon Martin? We have Trayvon Martin, we have Sean Bell, we had uh, 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 Ramali Graham, and the list just go Abner Luima. You know, uh, we just, the list just goes on and on, man. You know. Brothers and sisters don't feel safe in the streets. They don't feel like the NYPD is protect, you know, protecting them. And we just want to provide a platform for them to be able to express themselves. And that's part of the reason why Greg is here. That's why Ollie is here. T is there holding the camera, the graphics program. You know, we're doing it, man. And, and you know, we're providing something for kids, man. You know, we're providing an out. And, and, and the response has been phenomenal. I'm really blessed to have, you know, started a program that is really reaching individuals the way that it's reaching individuals. So all my school principals, I love you. Thank you for the support. To Greg, man, me and this cat, man, been doing it back and forth in the penitentiary for 25 years, man. And I'm blessed to have Greg in my life. Scrap is next. All the, you know, we gonna put it down for you, brother. Graphics. www.grafics.org. Thank you for listening to our communities, our children. Good night. God bless. Thanks a lot. More two minutes over. Sorry, guys. I got that. Good. Over.